Hi everybody. What's new the Outlander PHEV is brand new for 2023 and is a part of the fourth generation of the Outlander that was introduced in 2022. If you've been thinking about switching to an electric vehicle but are worried about the range, you might want to look into the most recent plug-in hybrids, which sit in the middle of all electric and gasoline power. The brand new 2023 Mitsubishi Outlander PHEV is the most recent plug-in hybrid SUV, and it has the potential to re-establish Mitsubishi's foothold in the United States. Equipped with a gasoline engine, a battery pack under the floor, and two electric motors, the Outlander PHEV is said to have a range of up to 38 miles on just electricity. The gasoline engine takes over once the battery is depleted, effectively eliminating range anxiety, despite the estimated 26 mpg fuel economy in this mode. It is estimated that rivals in this class get between 35 and 40 mpg. On a 240 volt charger, replacing the battery should take about 6.5 hours. However, the most expensive Outlander trim has DC fast charging capability, which can get you back to 80% charge in just 38 minutes. Sadly, a pre-existing CH8MO receptacle is required for that quick charge, which is being phased out of public charging stations. The Outlander PHEV compensates for its efficiency shortcomings with surprising strength and performance. It should reach 60 miles per hour in less than 7 seconds with immediate acceleration, but its sporty handling is the real start. In contrast to its rivals, Mitsubishi Super All-Wheel Control SOC, all-wheel drive system expertly sends power to specific wheels to maneuver through turns with inspiring precision. The 2023 Mitsubishi Outlander PHEV ought to be at the top of your list if you are one of the few drivers who is looking for more thrills from an SUV that is fairly efficient. The plug-in versions of the Hyundai Tucson, Ford Escape, and Toyota RAV4 Prime would be better suited to your needs if you are more concerned with achieving the highest level of efficiency. Thank you for watching. Leave a comment below and let us know what you thought of the video. We'll see you in the next one.